Chevrolet just barely confirmed the all-wheel drive C8 Corvette. It is also going to have an electric portion, which I think is cool because guess what? As unfun as electric cars are, my friends, they are fast. And there's no denying that they are very fast, which is why you're seeing Lamborghini, Ferrari, McLaren, all these supercar people adding an electric portion to their vehicles because my friends it increases the speed a ridiculous amount if you have never ridden in a tesla you need to take a ride in a tesla and ask the owner of that tesla to put it in berserk mode it is the nuttiest thing that you will ever experience however let's go ahead and read this article over on the roadandtrack.com website about the new c8 corvette which states the following the company Chevrolet says that it's working on a hybrid Corvette that is going to come early as next year, 2023, featuring an all-wheel drive. Corvette fans, you're going to want to sit down for this one. General Motors President Mark Roos, or Rouse, however you want to pronounce it, if you are one of those pronunciation warriors, has confirmed that Monday, the company is going to be working on an all-electric Corvette. Roos, Rouse, however you want to pronounce it, once again, also said that GM is planning to release a hybrid Corvette that could come as early as 2023. This is massive. And then there's a tweet on the article saying, breaking an electrified Corvette will be available as early as next year and a fully electric version to follow. Holy moly, that is a loud tweet right there. I hope I don't have my desktop audio on. Yo, all right, hold up. Let me... Uh, we got to listen to that, dude. That sounds like hella beast mode. Reaction of the new C8 Corvette sound. Unmute desktop audio. You ready for this? Wow, it's music. Never mind. That was lame. Epic reaction of the musical C8 Corvette. Rouse released a statement on his personal LinkedIn profile on Monday morning detailing Chevrolet's plans for the future of the Corvette and also ended up sharing a video of what looks like to be a camouflage C8 generation Corvette with power going to all four of the wheels, testing it in the snow. Though Rouse's statement doesn't go into details about the powertrain layout, this hybrid Corvette will likely retain a gas motor powering the rear wheel. Holy moly, that's a long sentence powering gas motor powering the rear wheels and an electric motor or motors spinning the front wheels think porsche 918 spider drivetrain it's not yet known whether the hybrid corvette is going to use the base c8 6.2 liter push rod v8 or the new 5.5 liter flat plane crank v8 in the z06 i read that so incorrectly that i'm actually going to leave it in the video so that everybody watching this can laugh at me best reader in the world regardless we're expecting the car to make a combined horsepower of above the z06's 670 horsepower rating though chevy has yet to release any details on naming the hybrid or fully electric corvette we expect that the former is going to be called the e-ray if rumors stemming from 2022 are to be believed it's not clear if the all-electric car is going to carry a similar naming scheme. If you still want your Corvette to burn gas once the electric version arrives, don't worry. Rouse says that the Chevy plans to sell internal combustion Corvettes alongside the fully electric versions, according to Phil Labau on Twitter. But yeah, man, let me know down in the comment section below what you guys think about this. I think it's awesome because I have ridden in a Tesla before, and again, I completely understand the gas powered type cars there. They have more of a oomph to them because you get the sound. You're like, I get it. You know what I mean? But there is no denying that Teslas are like obnoxiously fast. If you go in the Model S, I'm pretty sure is what model it is. And then you have the person put it in berserk mode. Nutty. It's like zero to like hundred in like three seconds, bro. It's it's ridiculous. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know what you think about this down in the comment section below. Throw a thumbs up. If you did enjoy it, subscribe. If you're new to the channel, check out one of these videos that are on screen. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace.